Today's video is about subwoofers and subwoofer boxes. I prefer to listen to music from the 80s and 90s, mostly rap. That's uh, my type of music and this is what the video is mainly about. Uh, rap music, uh, the bass, I like the 30 to 35 Hertz to me it is a nice deep bass that I like about the 80s and 90s rap if you already have a subwoofer in your car or even in your home a good way of figuring out uh, what frequency your system is playing or plays good uh, is a frequency test. This test will give you a sweep or a sound that is constant across many frequencies, but you'll notice that the sound will ramp up and down depending on the sound. This is because the subwoofer is usually tuned to play a specific frequency really well and the rest not so good. In my case, my box was tuned to about 34 Hertz that was as close as I can get to 30 due to the space that I had in my trunk that I was willing to give up the biggest recommendation that I have is consulting an expert go to a local stereo shop and let them know what your expectations are and also your budget to see if what you want and what you can have is realistic. I strongly recommend that you make a cardboard box as a template so you can fit in your trunk to know how much space you're giving up as well as it will let the expert know what size speaker they can fit in there and also that will dictate the amp that you'll need to drive the speaker. Sometimes reality and expectations uh, are not the same so you'll have to compromise whether it be in the size of box or in the sound that you'll end up having at what frequency your sub will play the best at When talking to an expert, don't be afraid to ask questions. They want to sell you something, but don't let them sell you something that you won't be happy with in the future. I've had many pre-made boxes that I have bought and I was never happy with them until I had a custom box made. For me, it was a huge difference in sound and quality.